at noon, it may not feel like winter, but Mass DOT says they're getting ready for when snow finally arrives, and the agency says they are more prepared than ever. For a closer look at the changes, Louisa Muller is live for us in Milton. So what's going on there, Louisa? Well, Catherine, you know, Pamela's talking rain. These guys are talking snow, always talking snow. And they say it's about learning from learning lessons from last year uh, and practice, 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 taking out your equipment, trying it, using the new ice melter. And of course, as the sign suggests, being prepared for anything. The sky may be snow free, but in the eyes of the Mass Department of Transportation, winter's coming. So on Thursday, DOT flexed its muscles, showing off its small army of shovels, plows, and ice melters, which destroy 120 tons of snow and ice an hour. We have over 380,000 tons of salt. We have 750,000 gallons of liquid de icer. 4,000 pieces of equipment in total and manpower. A lot of it. The men and women who go without sleep, who work overtime, who wake up and, and come out in the storm. But Highway Administrator Thomas Tinlin says they can't do it alone. Massachusetts drivers must gear up too. When you're shoveling out your vehicle at home, start with the tailpipe. Clear snow and ice from windows, lights, the hood of your vehicle. And also, just as importantly, the roof of your vehicle. The overarching theme of the news conference, if it comes, we're ready. If it doesn't... There, there are people in the department who have said that they'll feel like they rented the tux for the prom and then their date stood them up. I am not <laughs> one of those people. I'm perfectly good with saving the entire snow and ice budget. I think a lot of us are in the same boat as the DOT secretary there, but they say you have to be careful. We've all been in those situations where you've gone to work, there's no bad weather, you're coming home, and there's snow. So DOT suggests having a safety kit in your car that could include a scraper, de-icer, non-perishable foods, and blankets, warm blankets, things like that. Uh, we're all getting ready for it. We'll see if it actually comes. Live in Milton, Louisa Moeller, WBZ News.